A criminal investigation into alleged forgery and possible theft by county employees. One employee is in jail and out of a job. Two others are on administrative leave while the investigation continues. Word of the investigation came to light during a news conference this morning. ABC 7's Stephanie Valle was there and has the details. It's a story developing now. The investigation centers around parking fees generated by events at Escarate Park. Events like Beats and Eats, the Sun City Music Festival, and the various mud runs. 32-year-old Myra Navarrete is under arrest. The seven-year county employee is charged with 24 counts of forgery. The arrest affidavit shows Navarrete admitted to forging the names of employees overseeing the forms documenting money accepted for event parking, then also signing off on the forms. We have reason to believe that uh, the reason for that forgery was to cover up the differences in the amount of money. No theft charges have been filed yet. Two other employees identified by the county as Steve Lazarine and Ray Chavez are on administrative leave pending the investigation. You have to remember these are public funds. This money belongs to you and I. Uh, it goes into the county general fund to help offset costs. We communicated with the sheriff's department that uh, Something may be, may be wrong here. Commissioner Carlos Leon said he suggested that county employees overseeing events at Escarate count cars, issue receipts, and provide security for money handlers. I was taken aback in hearing all the resistance to some of these changes that I was suggesting. Their resistance is what actually triggered my suspicion. Leon said the county is now working to update cash handling procedures. The investigation isn't complete, so at this point, we don't know when this alleged fraud began or how much money may have been skimmed from the county's public fund. Stephanie Valle, ABC7.